Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome back to another Vintage Collection action figure review. We've got number 205, Lando Calrissian. Very much long awaited this one. It's been oh, now 16 years I think since the last Bespin Lando came out. We did have a comic one somewhere in the late 2000s um, that had a red, red cape. Um, but this one looks pretty definitive to me. It looks fantastic. Looks great on the card. Should have been put out a long time ago, to be honest, but uh, better late than never, I guess, hey? And yeah, this one's looking absolutely fantastic. Like I said, VC205 there on the back. Just reviewed Palpatine, and uh, hopefully IG-11 is not too far away either. But yeah, I'm really, really excited to replace the old Lando with the swivel elbows. Because <laughs> boy, does it need does it need replacing? So let's crack this one open and take a look, guys. All right, folks. Here is Lando Calrissian. Uh, what a spectacular figure this is. This is really, really nice. Digging it. Really, really digging it. This is absolutely fantastic. This is. As far as I'm concerned, this is uh, the the best Lando to date uh, in three and three quarter inch. Uh, yeah, just the head sculpt, new head sculpt, just fantastic, and the paint detail that's just remarkable. It looks so good. Um, well, let's take a look at him next to the old one here. Now this one is from. Let me just check under the feet. Let's take that blue tack. He's not going to be hanging around much more. 2004. So it's been that long, 15 years since this one. <laughs> and now we have this one here. I'll say one thing I do like about this cape is that they sort of hemmed it. Whereas this one, I mean, hopefully that's not going to fray. It looks like a nice, looks like a nice quality um, fabric. So hopefully that's not going to, um, you know, fray. Um, this got some stitches in the back just to keep those sort of frills in it, those folds in the cape, so that looks nice. Collar up the top, you know, that part of the separate part. Um, whereas this sort of plastic molded on the back there. But yeah, we don't need to look at this one anymore. Because <laughs> this is where the money is. This is fantastic. So yeah, really nice. This is just iconic Lando. Empire Strikes Back. Nice bright dark blue. <laughs> bright dark blue slacks. Uh, the black belt, the nice, the, you know, bright, brighter, bright blue shirt. Yeah, just, just fantastic. He comes with this blaster, sort of rebel blaster there, that looks nice. And even the details there of his wrist communicator is fantastic. Yeah, you got to have that. There's a lot low bots coming out next year, so we're, we're ready. <laughs> We've got Lando. We just need that new Lobot, and we're good. We are good. Um, the carbon freeze chamber is filling up nicely. Just some more Ugnaughts, Hasbro. I think re-release those Ugnaughts from the Legacy Collection, and we'll be good. Maybe chuck a couple more. Just a, just a couple more Ugnaughts. that would just really set that scene off. So yeah, articulation is pretty pretty solid. Looks good. Um, joints aren't too tight they look they look nice um, they've done pretty good with that you know, some of these new vintage collection figures some of the joints look a little bit funny and uh, you know they, they're prone to breaking so you really need to get some heat onto them before you start moving them around um, and you do that by a hair dryer or soaking them in boiling water either or just loosen up that plastic before you bend the joints but these seem pretty nice um, yeah the I don't see the need for uh, the swivel cut and the thighs on three and three quarter inch, but they've done it anyway, so we'll take it. It's a little bit more dynamic. I'm not a big fan of the leg joints. I mean, they're, they're just in terms of look, otherwise they're fine. Um, but I guess that's where that sort of thigh cut comes in. They just don't feel super tough. And you can kind of just see in the, just in there at the top, the tiny little peg that's holding them into the, uh, into the, Lando's, Lando's crutch. <laughs> it's a blessed, blessed crutch. Lando Calrissian. No, this is a, this is a great figure. If we pop off the head, 
that cape should just come off so we can have Bespin escape Lando. So, you know, he loses his cape part way through that, that escape. I can't remember when he takes it off or when he loses it. I think it's when Chewbacca chokes him, he drops the cape. But that looks nice. You can, you know, you can have him in this mode. I think that looks quite good. Give him the blaster. Chewie's another one we could do with an upgrade, like a nice Empire Strikes Back Chewie. I know we've had a few Chewies, um, but like 3PO in pieces, you know, maybe a nicely sculpted 3PO in pieces on, on Chewie's back. That would be a cool addition. Um, there's always options for, for expanding and growing the action figure line, especially with original trilogy. You know, people are always going to buy original trilogy stuff. And uh, if you're getting good, ver best versions of figures like this, this is to me definitive Lando. Um, Empire Strikes Back. Again, 15 years. Big difference. Those swivel cut elbows, they were. <laughs> they left a lot to be desired. But it, it got us through for a long time. I'll be honest, this figure has got us through for a very long time but I am absolutely very welcoming of this new update loving the Lando's getting some love well, Lando gives everyone the love <laughs> fantastic stuff well done Hasbro you've got my tick of approval for this one again big thanks to Angel Grove Collectibles for, for getting this one and Palpatine out to me um, just before the weekend, I was really excited to uh, get some videos out, out for the weekend, so thank you all so much for watching. I'd love to hear your thoughts down in the comments below. We'll see what you guys think about this Lando. I <laughs> like. I think I've said it. I've, I think I've given it enough praise that you, you get my thoughts. So I'm pretty wrapped on this one. I think it looks good. It's, you know, it's not perfect, but. Uh, which, which figure are, are, are perfect? There aren't many that aren't perfect, so... But uh, it's as good as we're going to get, I think, in this sort of scale, this day and age. I think it looks good. I think it looks really good. And the fact that they went soft goods, whereas the uh, Black Series one got a sculpted cape. I think this could have worked for Black Series too, this, this sort of style cape. And uh, if they ever do get around to updating that Lando, um, yeah, this is the way to go. I'd love to see that someday. But, uh, I think this looks good. Anyway, please drop a comment below. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And hit the little notification bell so you get all my future videos sent to your inbox and alerting on your phone and whatever. So you know when they've dropped straight away. So thank you very much for watching. This has been a Lando Calrissian production. Stay smooth, traveler. <laughs> and may the force be with you, folks.